All right, so this is my six foot by 12 foot cargo trailer camper. It's, I got an air conditioner up here and I have this uh, plastic shield to keep the uh, condenser from getting dented up and knocked around from stones and whatever during transit. There's a spare tire. There is a uh, foot pedal right there and the back's a, a fold down ramp. I'm gonna open it up here <clears throat> and inside I have like just a regular carpet. I have a little refrigerator in here and a workbench with a uh, drill press and a vise. There's my air conditioner. And then I use this fan to kind of boost the uh, the cold air coming out and it blows it more towards the back. I have a small window here that uh, rolls out. That's from a, an older RV that I got from a friend of mine. This is an Adrian Steel shelf from an old work van. And this is my cooler. I keep my sodas in when I'm on the road and I don't have the uh, refrigerator running on shore power I can still reach back here and grab some sodas so my shore power comes in down here through that hole and there's my double male ended plug and it plugs in right there and there's my little night light that indicate that tells me that I have power so I have an outlet here and here's a switched power for the lights and the outside porch light. And there's some places that I've been in the camper. Here I have LED T8 style lights and these two lights light this place up really well. This one it will work if you're hooked up to your car but not really. Then I have a skylight. Here's some Home Depot shelves right here. And here's my bunk bed, and I have some ladder rungs that go up to the top bunk here. And this is the bottom bunk. The bottom bunk is actually definitely the more comfortable of the two, but I sleep up in the top bunk quite a bit because usually when I have somebody with me, I'm a little smaller than them. Here's some more extension cords for shore power, and I keep all my backpacking and hiking gear. Under here, I usually keep like a 10 foot by 10 foot little shelter and little lounge chairs tucked under here. And there's another, this is another shelf in the nose here, but we got a mattress in here for a third person to sleep in here if necessary. And then the bottom, I got some like tables and there's a solar panel in there for emergency power and then my stuff that stabilize my stuff that's this is my uh, mobile kitchen it's I don't know if you can read that all the way it just says mobile kitchen and it has all my kitchen equipment in it and so we have one two three four five six seven eight total outlets to plug in whatever your heart desires but they only go to the the front half here they don't go any farther past the f towards the back door. I have a couple hooks here. These are great for hanging your keys on. I have one there and I have one here near the door. And, and that's it.